Now when we finished our first schematics, I would like to tell you something about the shortcuts in Altium. What's the philosophy here? So first uh, I would like to show you the most uh, important shortcut or let's say the first shortcut I would like to show you is Shift F1. Shift F1 is used each time you want to know what exactly are the shortcuts applied in each action. Let's say I would like to move this component here. I started to moving it, I'm holding my left hand button down in the mouse and now I will press Shift F1. I see now all the shortcuts that are applicable to my action like zooming, redrawing, moving with cursor keys, pausing, flipping, rotating and so on. So let me show you what these shortcuts are. So first of all, page up, page down, will zoom in and out. I can also hold control key and rotate the mouse wheel. The next thing is moving with cursor keys. If I click each cursor key correspondingly, the component will move in that direction. If I press shift, now the grid will be 10 times larger. Okay. Now the next thing is, uh, if I move components somewhere away, I can press home button. And now the component will be actually pl placed in the middle of the screen or the other way around, the screen will be panned to the component. Okay, what else? Um, Shift F1, let me see. Um, pausing, if I click tab, I will actually go into the pause mode. And here I can set the properties of that resistor and then clicking pause, I will, I'm here again. What else? Um, rotating with space, like that. And shift space rotating in the other direction. If I press control space, I will actually select the way the line is connecting, so the angle and the beginning and the end of the line, so where the angle actually is made. And uh, Shift F1, let me see what else. Um, flipping with uh, corresponding to the X axis and the Y axis. Y and rotating and now X. Okay. So if I now start, let's say, draw a wire, I'm drawing a wire and now I'm pressing Shift F1, I will get all the shortcuts re regarding that wire. Like, for example, uh, backspace or space or shift space and all the, of course, the zooming and panning functions. Okay, let me show you the backspace or maybe space and shift space. Okay. What else? Um, if I want to move the, or pan the screen, I can click the right hand button and now the screen and the circuit is moving along the screen. Uh, the left hand button is for selecting from which is different from left to right and right to left and the right, right hand button is for panning. Now, what about the rest of the shortcuts? Well, here you see um, the menus and on the menu you see that uh, uh, letters are underscored, underlined. So let me go, let's say, if I go to place and select uh, wire, you see that w, w and P are underlined. So if I go here and I click, click P for place and W for wire, and actually going into place wire mode. I, like I was clicking here and the other shortcut is also control W here again. So um, all the shortcuts are made also with this um, underlined letter system. So let's say place port or place part or place bus, place power port, let's say place power port, P-O, and I'm here. So pressing P will show me the menu, I see R, port. So this is how you can easily learn the shortcuts and some of them are really uh, nice to remember because it will make your design much quicker.